Hello everybody, welcome to another rendition of the movie game. However, this time we're playing... Yeah. There we go, the romantic movie, movie game. Stop it, Steve! Shut up, Steve! You need an iron or a steamer. See, Steve saw it. They all told me to keep wearing the shirt. I'm afraid it's gonna look all wrinkly too. If you don't know how it works, you just take one movie synopsis, you smash it with another movie synopsis, and then you have to guess what the title of that new movie is. Got my other shirt if this looks like shit. I'm not much of a rom-com guy. I have a real soft spot in my heart for romantic comedies. Whitney, how you doing? I don't think I've seen a romantic comedy since like high school. Oh, no. and so I'm <laughs> That. I enjoy some romantic comedies, but I don't tend to watch them uh, ever. Hmm. Shocking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That does check out. Hey, before we get started, is there any lovely lady you want to say hi to? Yes, I'd like to say hello to my girlfriend, Jane, and also my girlfriend, Alana. Aww, Alana. My girlfriends. Man, this restauranteering family from a southeastern European country on the Aegean Sea sure is large. <laughs> hope they accept. What? Hope they accept the man who I have chosen for my husband, who happens to be a crooner from the 80s who specializes in crooning during events where nuptials are the highlight. What? Can you say some of the first part again? Can you read the first one? Okay, so the second one's the wedding singer. Yeah, yes. Okay, she's got what it. is got the... It. My big fat Greek wedding singer. Yeah! <laughs> uh, my big fat Greek wedding singer. Yeah, baby! Specializes in crooning during events where nuptials are the highlight. My big fat Greek wedding singer. He got it! Yay! Wow. Hey, my big fat Greek wedding singer. Yay! <laughs> I'm telling you, I women love love because it's all an illusion and it'll never happen how you think it's going to. Oh God, what's happening? Huh? <laughs> Matthew McConaughey bets he can make a pretty magazine columnist fall in love with him in just a little over a week, but definitely in less than two weeks. And hopefully just in time for him to heal up and race in the Daytona 500 against that dude from Princess Bride and the first Saw movie. And also Liar Liar. What, 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 no, no, no. Daytona 500, like Days of Glory? Is that the movie, Days of Glory? This might be the pickle of it. It's How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days. How to lose a guy in 10 Daytona 500? How to lose a guy in 10, what's the second one? Um. I start laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, hey, we're gonna need to watch that laugh. Watch that laugh, girl. Now it's time for I watch that, that laugh. <laughs> you win. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's go through this, all right? Okay, all right, okay. all right, let's go through okay. this. Okay. How to lose a guy in 10 days, I, I lose that. Ten How to lose a guy in 10 days, I got that. Okay. How to lose a guy in tal 10 Talladega Nights. And then what does O and F spell? Of? What's that, Days of Thunder? Mm -hmm. Days of Thunder is what uh -huh. it's called. Okay, and what what does this sound when it rains? Krakow! Krakow, thunder. Okay. Of thunder? Oh. Yay! Oh, yeah! <laughs> How to lose a guy in 10 days of cr of thunder. Yeah. <laughs> wow. You, know, <laughs> you got that one? Good Thanks. Job. Yeah, whatever. I just, I've been watching a lot of movies lately. I've been trying to catch up with you guys. It's a lot of fun. Don't test my love of love! <laughs> All right, ready? Yes. Uh, oh. Oh. Mm -mm. Oh. You have to stop. Uh, it's not like oh. it's just... I don't like it at all. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. We all have to mm. <laughs> I'll have what she's That's having. That's all you have to say is I'll have what she's having. I will play the game okay, the way I I'm want to play. I'm just saying. I'll have what she's having. A heaping plate of Connery and a dollop of literary figures like Tom Sawyer and Captain Nemo teaming up to fight evil. No. That's not real. <laughs> I don't remember a Sean Connery movie. <laughs> okay. When Harry met Sal. This is insane. <laughs> what do you call, like, baseball? It's like major blank baseball. When Harry met Sal. League of Extraordinary Gentlemen? Yes! Ah! <laughs> yeah, it's when Harry met Sal, League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. <laughs> Yeah, why do we why did I know that? We're so happy that he got it. Yeah. When Harry met Sally of Extraordinary Gentlemen. Yeah! <laughs> wow. That one that one washed me up. <laughs>
I gotta take a break <laughs> after that one. Hello, my name is Inigo Montoya. You killed my scientifically engineered monster woman who I plan to bequeath oh, to my scientifically engineered monster man. My name is Inigo Montoya. You killed my scientifically engineered monster woman who I plan to bequeath to my scientifically engineered monster man. <laughs> Prepare to die. <laughs> This guy's got a drinking problem. Why would you drink Gatorade on film again? <laughs> Prepare to die. I was I started drinking this out there in front of Steve, and there was like ten seconds of silence, and I didn't think anything about it. And I put it down, and he turns to me, and he just goes, "You know you have to finish your vegetables before you go to bed tonight, right?" <laughs> I just lost it. <laughs> Princess Bride of Frankenstein. Yeah, baby. <laughs> <laughs> The Princess Bride of Frankenstein. Yay! 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 The Princess Bride of Frankenstein? <laughs> uh-huh. All right. Princess Bride of Frankenstein? Yeah! I'm starting to understand how this game works. Yay! Lee, you've gotten oh. every single one. I'm so very excited. I really am. Pressure's on. Uh-huh. Here we go. A young, love-struck guitar player falls head over heels for the new girl. But to win her affection, he must defeat all of her former zombie lovers who are spreading across the globe, threatening to end humanity as we know it. Oh, this is the one. Oof, yeah. Um. Okay, do the zombie one again, because I, I feel like I always get caught up in like, oh, I know this one, and then I stop listening. <laughs> <laughs> Love struck guitar player falls head over heels for new girl. I don't know this one. You really? You got me. I think you do you know it. Scott Pilgrim. Is that Scott Pilgrim versus the world? Mm -hmm. Okay. Scott Pilgrim versus the world dawn of the dead? Ooh. World 28 days later? <laughs> world... I don't know this one at all. Oh. What a sad day. <laughs> <laughs> you ruined everything. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Uh, I think it's I think it's like Scott Pilgrim versus the world. Uh, uh, uh. Scott Pilgrim versus world, world, war of the worlds. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 Scott Pilgrim versus the world war Z. Yeah. <laughs> Scott Pilgrim versus the world war Z. Yay! Yeah, I mean, is it Scott Pilgrim? What's nope. the last letter nope. in the alphabet? Scott Pilgrim versus versus the world, and then and then the, the defeat oh. all the former hmm? World War Z. Yay! Yay! <laughs> it is Scott Pilgrim versus the World War Z. There you go. You <laughs> got it. That made me so sad. <laughs> I almost didn't get that, and that would have made me real sad. Last one. This okay. one's a little bit of curveball. A little different, but you'll get it. Okay. Best Picture Oscar winner, considered by many as the best romantic comedy of all time. Features a neurotic comedian and a ditzy singer with unforgettable hits like Rich Girl, Private Eyes, and Man Eater. Kisses Bee Gees. I don't understand. <sighs> or no, 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 sorry, Hall and Oates. Yeah, I mean, I know that's Hall and Oates. What's the best romantic comedy of all time? <laughs> Is it is it a Woody Allen movie? Yeah. I don't know it. Oh, no. Is it Annie Hall? Oh, that's the one. Oh, Annie Hall and Oates. Comedian. <laughs> Annie Hall and Oates. <laughs> <laughs> Annie Hall. It should be noted that the latter part is just a band. It's a band, not a movie. Not a movie. This is the Annie movie. Hall and Oates. Holy sh! Wow. <laughs> yes, of course, the nanny hollow Just one note of it. What happened? Just because you said band? A hollow notes? Yay! 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 Uh, on your own, man, That's wonderful. I'm in, I, I feel in love now, after yeah. all of this. I feel like I fell in love with these movies all over again. Do you want to go and watch all of them again? Mm, no. What's your favorite romantic comedy of all time, Leith? Great question. Um, probably you've got mail. I don't think you mean that. No, I do. My best friend's wedding. Yeah, it's great. It's a great one. <laughs> Elliot, what's your favorite rom-com? I think definitely Maybe is really good. And, um, I really like You've Got Mail. <laughs> <laughs> so do I! Really? Did you yeah, say You've Got Mail? I, 
That's a good movie. I was like, I was like, Lee, I don't believe you. Yeah. You're getting better every time. I'm getting better and I'm trying to pay attention. And did I Google popular romantic comedies before this video? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Oop! Time for a bonus round. Watch that lamp. Watch the wrong. We're watching the wrong.